In this video, I'm gonna show you my absolute favorite little blitzing concept that you can utilize to pretty much neutralize most of the five wide formations in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, I wanna encourage you right now to click the subscribe button, turn on those notifications so that you don't miss any of the videos. If you don't turn on the notifications, I found that YouTube won't let you know whenever we release a new video, and we release a new video multiple times a day. So make sure that you get those notifications on, that way you know whenever we release a new video. Now let's talk about the nickel triple. The nickel triple is one of my favorite defense. It's probably my it's probably my favorite defense. Two four five odd is really good too, and you can actually combine the two, which is really cool. And you combine three three five wide and three five will, so you can get all of this pat this this um, nickel package uh, out of the Bears playbook. It's why the Bears playbook is so good. But nickel triple is really really good. It's really good for a lot of different reasons. One of the reasons it's so good is because you can send significant, and I mean significant. A gap pressure out of this formation. So uh, I'm going to show you how to do that against the five wide. It's probably the best defense, in my personal opinion, for the five wide in the entire game. So what we're going to do is we are simply going to call it. it, it you, you can call any play, but I personally like to do this most out of the cover six defense. I think it works the best out of the cover six or the cover two. One of those two coverages, I think this works really, really well out of. And it's really simple setup. It's actually literally like two buttons. All we're going to do is we are going to flip our play just like this. And we're going to globally blitz our linebackers. Now we need to make sure that this linebacker right here, we're going to put him right there. Okay, we really need to make sure that he's right in that location. And then at the snap of the ball, what you're going to see is we're going to come down just for a second. And as you see, we're getting edge heat. Now, 99% of the time, every now and then it kind of, kind of fit, finagles a little bit. But the majority of the time, if we run this on flip just like this right here and then just grab this guy before he goes, we're going to get A-gap pressure. You might need to stand a little bit closer, hold left trigger right here. Um, but what you're going to see is you're oftentimes going to get this A-gap pressure coming through from that, that safety that we've put into the A-gap uh, or into the B-gap. So we'll show it to you one more time. And again here, we're just going to simply sit right here, snap the ball. And as you see, we're going to consistently get edge heat. Uh, we'll consistently get edge heat. A lot of times, like I said, we will get this A-gap pressure. Now, another way that you could create the same basic concept is just straight up blitz your linebackers as is. So we're literally just going to come out, blitz our linebackers, and then we can stand like right here. And you'll see we'll also oftentimes get that 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 a gap pressure. Part of it is practice mode is being a little bit finicky right now uh, because I've run this blitz a little bit too much. But as you can see here, you know if you get this guy in this gap right here. Nine times out of ten, you're going to get this A-gap. Nine times out of ten, you're going to get it. So, again, it's coming like that. And there you see. See how that A-gap is kind of fighting to come in? It's just not quite coming in all the way. But the beauty of this is you're going to guarantee pressure. You're going to get pressure out of this. Um, it's just a matter of we want to try to get this to come through the A-gap. So, let me show it to you one more time. There you see. There you see. There's the A-gap in the edge. So, that's what I'm talking about. So, it's double pressure off of this. And so, all you need to do is just simply flip your play, global blitz your linebackers. Like I said, you can stand right here, and at the snap of the ball, you should get double pressure. So this is one of my favorite blitzes in the game, uh, especially for five wide, because out of five wide sets, they're, they're, at best they're going to block a tight end. Most of the time they're not going to block anybody, and it allows you to create significant pressure. Now, how do we stop some of the quick reads out of this? Well, the way we stop the quick read is by showing blitz so you can show blitz it's going to bring that guy down in the box so they've got to kind of at least respect that and then as you see there the pressure is going to come in so fast it's really hard for them to make a read that's the beauty of this defense so thanks for watching the video and if you want to get the entire nickel triple defensive ebook it's on sale for just 15 dollars. there's a link in the description below if you click that link it'll take you right over to the website where you can get the guide for just 15 bucks